Good evening, it's Friday, October 27th, and welcome to this SCW News Digest. Officers are investigating the second inmate homicide at Duell Vocational Institute since August. In the most recent case, a woman was found, oh, excuse me, a man was found unresponsive in his cell. As for the one in August, a 34-year-old was found dead in a pool of his own blood. The institute located in or located near Tracy houses nearly 2,200 and has been open since 1953. Yesterday, files relating to the investigation into the assassination of former President John F. Kennedy were released by the National Archives. Current President Donald Trump did withhold some documents. Now, 2,891 documents in total were released, and if you want to see them, you can visit the National Archives website. And as you may have noticed, uh, as you may have hopefully noticed by now, if you have kids, I'm sure you already have, Halloween is just around the corner, only about four days away. Now, there are plenty of Halloween events going on this weekend in and around Stockton. One of them is tomorrow, and it's from, or one of them tomorrow and today, and it's from 5 to 8 p.m. at Mickey Grove Zoo. It will feature family-friendly family friendly crafts and games, as well as some early trick-or-treating. The event is called Hollow Wild, and tickets are $1 to $5, depending on your age. Now to this next one is kind of cool as well. The Stockton Air Arena will be open to children 12 and younger who want to ice skate in their Halloween costumes. Tickets are 5 to $12 and that includes skate rentals. The arena will be open from 1 to 4 on, sun on Saturday. Finally, if you want to enjoy a play this weekend, the Rocky Horror Show will be acted out at That Showbiz co Company on Miracle Mile or Pacific Avenue in Stockton. There are a few different showtimes. You can get those, you can catch those showtimes at brownpapertickets.com, and I've heard some pretty good things about the plays there, so hopefully it will be a good time. Well, thanks for watching this SCB News Digest. I'll see you again next week.